Welcome back to the next section of traffic training. In this section, we're gonna cover traffic providers. What is a provider? How can we configure a provider? And we'll take a little bit deeper look into the actual Docker provider. Let's get started and take a look at the different use cases of providers. So first let's start with what is a provider? A provider actually links your traffic deployment to an infrastructure component. For example, an orchestrator, a container engine, a key value store, or just a flat file. Traffic, once connected to this provider, so for example, if we connect it to Docker, then traffic knows exactly what to look for and it detects configuration changes or any events coming from Docker automatically. Example is a new container starts. It's informing traffic directly when a container starts. Traffic then registers this container automatically and pulls all the configuration into traffic so we don't have to do anything. So traffic knows exactly what to look for. Uh, it detects routers and different things. And this is all done through the provider. And then how do we actually configure a provider is different components. You can actually see there's a list of available traffic providers in 2.x. And here's the list of providers that are supported in 2.x. And you can see the providers available, the type of provider. So example, orchestrators, Docker, Kubernetes, console, Marathon, Rancher, or there's the manual for the file or key value stores. Then you can see in the final column is a configuration type. So how do we configure these uh, particular providers for traffic? In the Docker uh, example, we actually configure traffic using labels. So we pass labels to traffic, for example, telling traffic to uh, refresh to provider connection every two seconds, for example. Or we can actually pass different variables to, to traffic to, for the API call that it does back and forth between Docker and traffic. Let's take a closer look at actually what's available in the provider. And we can do that right in the documentation. So docs.traffic.io, providers, Docker. And you can see under configuration discovery, and here's the different providers available in 2.x. Now, once we get into the providers of Docker, you can see there's all the routing configuration. We can set up swarm mode within traffic. We can then define the networks available. Um, and we can also go down exactly how Swarm should operate together with traffic. So these are all the configurations. Um, it's quite simple to set up. There's a the getting started. So you can see right away that um, traffic is quite easy to set up with Docker, which we'll, we'll walk through in the lab so you can see exactly how this works. Now, you may notice that there's some providers that are missing. And that's because in, in 1.7, 1.7 had more providers available and not all of them have been ported over to 2.x yet. So the community and traffic is still working on uh, porting these back over to 2.x, but here's a list of what's still running in 1.7 and still waiting on the porting over to 2.0. Now we will jump into the lab on exactly setting up traffic with the Docker provider and configuring the different uh, variables and labels available to the Docker provider. Join me in the next section.